it's very thought provoking for me to think that this is where something a sauce that I created in my kitchen with my kids would have brought me to, you know to the journey where it's brought me. Uh, Levi's is is already a character that people like you know when they saw him on Dragon's Den and people really relate to him you know he's a, um, a real hero. I wanted to use Ardman because the style is a style that is recognizable everywhere. It also is very warm and friendly and appealing, rather like Levi. One of the main challenges that we faced was taking human features, eyes, nose, face, and actually making them at a scale which our animators could handle. And so one of the biggest differences on this job is that Levi Roots is uh, about half a metre tall, and that's so that the animators can actually get in and animate all the details that are needed in his face. We have done some animations before. We know the process is very long, and uh, from the beginning it was it's quite tricky because you can imagine, but you never you're not sure about how you'll be the result, the final result. But it's because it was art, you, know, you are so confident, so relaxed about that. To take a real human being and caricature them um, without uh, misrepresenting them is quite a challenge. Uh, normally, you know, we're very happy animating dogs or inanimate objects and, and make, giving them human attributes. We're actually taking a real person and recreating them in uh, stop motion animation. It's very surreal, actually. I, I never did I ever thought that, you know, this would happen to me type thing like where a, a sort of an image um, would be made of you and to come alive as well. It's really, it's like watching myself on the TV all over again when I first came out of the Dragons and I say, is that really me looking so sexy and thing <laughs> on the thing on the TV? Yeah. And I want to say, yeah, it's kind of sexy still, you know. When we're working with, uh, with animation, it takes, it takes people like the small leaps of faith. And because Ardman did such a good job uh, creating the bust, um, it required a smaller leap of faith. So when he looked at himself and he went like, whoa, I can really see where this is going. And he was really into it right from the start. The heart of what Levi Roots is all about is this song. You put the sauce on your food and your food does something different. And the nice thing about animation is it gave us an opportunity to show what happens to food when you put sauce on it and the way that it comes to life. Give me some reggae, reggae sauce. Hot reggae, reggae sauce. It's so nice. I had to name it twice. We call it reggae, reggae sauce. At reggae, reggae sauce. For me, music was something that was always in me, and you always come back to whatever you really are. And I think music is, is me, you know, that's in my blood. And no matter what else I try to do, it always sort of comes back to, to having a guitar around my waist and, you know, and writing lyrics. The essence of getting good character animation is getting to the bottom of what makes the character live and breathe. And then because Levi is such a natural performer, he gave us everything we needed very easily. Somebody put some music in the food for me. Give me some reggae, reggae sauce. Hot reggae, reggae sauce. It's so nice, I had to name it twice. Me call it reggae, reggae sauce. Hot reggae, reggae sauce. Just like my baby, it is the perfect delight. Perfect delight. It's got some peppers and some herbs and spice. Me want some reggae, reggae sauce. Hot reggae, reggae sauce. It's so nice with your jerk chicken, make burgers finger licking. On your barbecue and your drumsticks, just put some reggae, reggae sauce on your dish. <laughs>